I was confused and stumbling around in my favorite grocery store Publix with a scribbled list of ingredients for a mango salsa recipe. I wrote it in a hurry and I couldn't quite figure out what that last item was. And finally, a helpful produce guy, Joe, saw I was in distress and came to my rescue. I showed him my list and he couldn't read my chicken scratch either. Cucumber? He then took out his personal cell and called his wife. I sat there patiently, well, patiently eavesdropping. He asked his wife what they put in their mango salsa, and then he smiled at me and said, Cilantro, it's cilantro. Joe and I exchanged an awkward high five. I grabbed my cilantro and I was on my way. If you're not familiar with Publix, then you are deprived. It's a grocery store that is well lit, stocked perfectly, and has a lot of helpful employees. However, there's one caveat. Their prices are a little higher than average. Conversely, there's another grocery store right around the corner from me. It's Aldi. And Aldi is no public. The store isn't quite as up to date. The shelves are not stocked perfectly, but hey, all three employees are very helpful. Aldi does have similar produce and dry goods, but their prices are lower. Both are good grocery stores with two very different niches. Publix focuses on experience. Aldi focuses on simplicity. So which are you? Publix or Aldi? There's not a right or wrong answer. Unless you try to say it's a mixture of both. That's the wrong answer. That's not a niche. That's the same thing everyone says, especially your competitor. If you're in insurance or finance, it's time to take a stand. And taking a stand will let you stand out.